say to you that I really don't think you fully understand what has happened to these people that you look at as second class or inferior citizens in this nation. Black people who were brought to this country were stripped of their names, language, culture, religion, God, and taken totally away from the history of themselves. Here are 30 million people who don't wear their own names. They wear your names. Who don't speak their own language. They speak English, which is not their language. They never, never were allowed their own cultural expression of Africa. Don't you realize that when you turn a people upside down and inside out, then sell them, not for a day, not for a year, but for 300 years and deny us the human right to know, to read a book, to learn, to understand. And then, after 100, uh, 300 years of that, you allow us into the church, but by that time, you've painted Jesus white, God white, the angels white, and then all these black people have been subjected to a form of white supremacy which produces in the reverse a black inferiority. And this is fulfilling what Jesus said, as a man thinketh. So is he, and as long as our people think the way they think, we will never be able to do what we as a people should do to correct our condition. Over here. Ife Ibo, the first son of EJ. Ife, the grandfather of Odudu Owa. Oni Oro Oba was a soldier in the match of Odudu Owa on the Uncle Territory Agbomi Doru Ike at Anehiho, the Ewe Ibo, there Odudu Awas. Requestion Personnes requisited for the nickname of Oni Oru Oba, the soldiers need and spoil the victor's wealth was Oba, requisition the defeated in the unit of Oru, the individual was referred as Oye or Oba, it apple at Anehiho, the Ewe Ibo, and Toss. Ife, Aba Okute, and Oyo Omo Ibo, clothes according to the stiffness and high handed. Unit command led by the general commander title the leader in the worry world to be continued.